upstairs. You'll have your sleeping bag and pillow, and that's about it. So from that, we'll go upstairs. Okay, this this is the kitchen. This is where <laughs> this is where many happy stomachs are made. Uh, you'll see that that in in past uh, we used to have really a stove over here every morning. Somebody would get out the alumin, aluminum percolator, coffee pots, get the coffee percolating on all the burners. So as people would wake up, they could come downstairs and do a fresh cup of coffee. Uh, nowadays we have a uh, coffee maker and it's very fast and efficient and we can you know easily put out 100 cups of coffee in about 15 minutes time uh, this refrigerator is the original Frigidaire refrigerator uh, that was put in sometime around the early 50s and I'll open the door and the racking and everything hasn't really changed inside of here is just our vent and a motor doing an air exchange inside there so it's bringing in the air from the outside, and that's what keeps everything cold in there. So that is very active. We still use it. Uh, we have many pieces like that throughout the cabin that have been here for decades, and we're still using them on a daily basis. We've upgraded our stoves. We have nice dry storage, so folks can come in and put their dry goods in certain, pla on, in certain areas, closets for towels, etc. So we have two double sinks is here, lots of areas for pots and pans and dishes and cups and glasses and all that wonderful stuff. And you can see that the cabin, even after lunch hour, people still gather around and socialize and just really have a good time talking about their day and what they're going to do and solving all the world's problems, as we like to say. So from here, the last piece of the cabin is the dormitories. So this area here is the dormitories. They're actually split, women's and men's. When you arrive at the cabin, you would go upstairs, put your name on a bunk. They're all numbered. Lay out your sleeping bag. And on the men's side is exactly the same. <clears throat> so these bunks were actually uh, brought up, constructed. The mattresses were actually got from the Navy Department in... I want to say sometime in the 50s, and they've recently been remade, uh, although we do have some original mattresses still around here, so that weren't used very much. At any rate, that's our dorms here.